live um, and I'll start up the oh is everyone connected to my um, twitch stream no one moment I'll just share the uh, link with you That it. All right, so I'll fire up the introduction then. Last time on Tomb of Annihilation, the Silver Sashes fight their way deeper into the vein of the Night Serpent and towards the lair of Rosnissi, confronting the Yanti in their horrific temple. They deploy the bunny grenade and unleash the full fury of a mightily confused Hydra, taking advantage of the chaos and carnage raging through the ranks of their foes. Our heroes launch a surprise attack from behind on the survivors, and soon silence reigns once more in the bowels of the Fane. But a Yanti priestess has managed to slip away and is no doubt bent on the Sash's demise. The party gives chase and is met with a gruesome silence. A blood slick sacrificial room. Its altar and floor overflowing with wet bones and gore. Here, the priestess with her priest are finishing a terrible rite, chanting along with the animated skulls of their victims. Can the silver sashes interrupt the foul ritual of the Yanti clergy? Are these abominations the last to stand between our heroes and Rosnissi? And will there be more Lagomorph surprises? Come, find out next time on Tomb of Annihilation. Very dramatic this week, and you uh, lots of battling last time. And so, uh, as uh, the good narrator said, you are facing off now against a room full of Yuanti and chanting skulls. Mac, you're up. We don't have the map. We do now. Oh, and also, as a um, Fancy Grounds cheat thing, um, if you open up your combat tracker and you click on your um, icon, um, on the left hand side for you double click it or whatever it'll automatically open up whatever map that token is um, Located on so if your map shuts down or whatever, um, I mean I'll always open it for you if you ask but um, You can uh, do it yourself by double clicking that Nice didn't know that Cool, I, I didn't know that for years Double click on what? On the combat tracker on your little token there it's amazing. Fantasy Grounds is a bit like an iceberg. 90% of it stays hidden. Yes, it is. Um, I only found that one out recently. Ah, it's that really handy work. as a player when I'm playing games I use it all the time. I can't double click and it won't open the map had I actually closed the map. Um, Hack, if you want, you can... Oh, sorry, go ahead. No, go ahead. Um, also, in images and maps on your right side, Oops. you'll be able to have a list of all things um, shared. Yeah, a uh, few, five pages of them, yes. It, it should, ah, should. yes, page one of two. Okay. <laughs> it should, does it not work for you, Mac, if you double click? It might be because you've got a. Um, you might need to be really accurate about where you click on your token on the combat tracker. So it's on the image part of the uh, token. On the. Uh, it's it's on on your combat tracker. Yep. Yeah, and it should be on the image part of the token. I think if you double click it. Hmm. It doesn't work for me either. And actually, minimizing <laughs> the map actually removes it completely. There used to be a little token I could click on, and now it's gone. No, my my. Oh, it, do you know what? It might just be in the Savage Worlds rule set then. Um, I presume it could be. Just could be, a, could be that the, the, track, uh, the token isn't properly connected or something. Just go to images and maps, and in the bottom you can type in Fane, and it will pop up only the maps that have the word Fane in it, and one of them is player map Fane of the Night Serpent. Uh, can you give me back the initiative? I accidentally uh, clicked. <laughs> That's fine. Next. 
Oh well, my um, handy tip wasn't a tip at all. Um, never mind, Mac, you're up. All right, so the skulls are probably dangerous, don't you think? I think they're all dangerous. The skulls are embedded into the uh, altar and are sort of all chanting. So, they do, do they away? look breakable? Uh, I'm guessing they can't run because they have no tiny legs. Yeah. Easier to hit them. I'd, I'd hit the Yantis first, really. I mean, Why? You want, to stop, you want to stop them from uh, chanting? Well, they're all chanting. And these Yanti have pretty nasty spells. I mean, if they, they suggest stuff again. True, that's true. Don't go too far. I mean, we can use this tunnel as a funnel. I Are thought they um, all ranged or? Sorry, are they all ranged, did you say? Yeah. Um. I just, like, asking. I, 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 I missed the chanting skull. God damn it. He's just sitting there. Yeah. Well, that's it. It's nine. just a decoration. Oh, I don't... It doesn't look like a decoration. And if they don't have skulls, then they can't do whatever they're trying to do. Well, you um, strike one of the skulls and it just shatters. Do you have some... Oh. Fine. Uh, four rounds, I keep hitting the guy there. Well, I don't hit. Oh no! Then I move back and stay here. And so they can't uh, attack us all at once. Do, do you have the um, feat that prevents you taking um, attack of opportunities or free attacks? Oh, whoops. Uh, I should. Should probably hit the other guy because yes, I do, but I hit the wrong guy. Whoops. Okay, it's good. Well, it's Br Brood Guard One, I think, is the only one that'd have a swipe at you. Yep. Do you still want to do that? Well, I would uh, like to undo my attack and attack him instead to avoid being attacked. But if I can't do that, um, is that the um? Go on then, I'll, I'll be nice because you're up against it. The critical miss one. So the critical miss missed the uh, Bulgar one instead, and I withdrew. Ah, yes, sure. Yeah, no problem. Then I'm done. Alright, so we've got number two here. He has to step around there. And he's got three attacks, one bite, two claw. Matt parries and dodges all of them. The dice haven't woken up yet. Hmm. Okay, I'll inch a bit closer. And what can I even hit from here? The skulls! Yeah, shatter the skulls. Yeah, okay. I think this one is just has a clear line. Duck. Well. <laughs> oh, it's already dead. Okay, I'll use my second attack then to hit this one. They appear pretty flimsy as your arrow strikes. It just shatters.
I'm very sorry, skulls of the innocent victims the young thief took once. And that's it for me. I look for the duck. <laughs> it's a spade duck. Hmm. I'll just uh, trash dock the skulls. Well, they're grinning at least. Yeah. Doesn't work on them. Bummer. Yeah, they appears to be immune to psychic damage, sadly. Well, they have no brains. I never bet. stopped uh, people I know. <laughs> I bet they're not immune to a mighty fireball. Yeah, but I am out of fireballs. Whose fault is that? Hmm. I'm gonna move behind Mac. And I think I'm going to cast Spirit Guardians. So that is in a space of 15 feet of me. So everyone, this area is gives a half speed to anyone that tries to go in. Plus everyone that starts his turn or goes into there has to make a saving throw. And if he fails, he gets 3d8, um, 3d8 radiant damage. Why is it circled on us? It's centered on me, but don't worry, you guys are safe. Ah, okay. So, sorry, what was the spell called? Spirit Guardians. Okay, better than one moment. Let's get the effects for you. It's the circle of angels, I think. Yeah. So what I'm not sure is when I cast it, do, do I cast the damage on the guys that are right, right now in it? Yeah, one moment. I'm just having a look. Just trying to... Add the spell with effect on for you. I put it in chat. Right, so you need concentration on yourself and then um if you control and left click at all the targets. I'm I'm not sure if I can do that on the guys that are in the circle when I cast it. Up to you, I guess. It's as if they start their turn or if they get into that. Alright, okay. Um Oh, you can see to be unaffected, I see. Um oh right, I understand. So it sort of sits there around you and Just waits for people to come in. When they start their turn, they'll have to roll. I understand, yep. 
so I guess I'm right. That was third level. Okay, um, yeah, I think that's it for my turn. Screaming Skull chants. You Kumbaya, want to hear me? my friend. <laughs> he gets damage. So, does he, he gets a save first, does he? Yep, and he failed. Okay, yep, drop the damage on him then, if you would. Awesome. Uh, he moves in, gets damaged, he's still standing but that hurt. Tries to bite at Mark. Okay, as a Bite you, but misses with the claws. And then the door to the north of Xander um, swings open, revealing a woman. Look at that. Xander always gets all the action. I wink. Who the bloody hell is that? This is Fendaza. A Yuanti who looks, um, who has an air of superiority um, about her, as if she's somebody who is used to her commands being, being obeyed. She says, wait, wait, stop the senseless destruction. I can offer you a deal, I can offer you life. If okay, I'm listening. If you halt this and go to Rasna's chamber and slay him, we will let you live alive. We'll let you leave alive. Wait, I thought we were killing them. It's not particularly much how she's uh, framing it. So we have to kill the head priest for you. I will give you the directions to the lair of Rasni. Yeah, we know, it's just around the corner. Yeah, you're not giving us much here. Plus, why do you want to, why do you want him dead? I have dreams, Dendar has prophesied his demise. What if we like Rasnisi? What if he's an okay guy, just a bit misunderstood? As you wish, then he shall die here today. Well, that's kind of something. <laughs> she you... also takes damage. <laughs> she does, yeah. Make her um, <laughs> get her flip a save on her, please. Ah, she passed. Oh dang! Well, it's half damage. Okay. So, isn't Rasnisi one of you guys? Yeah, I mean, she... if you're so powerful, why don't you kill him? I am disappointed in him of late. He clings to his humanity, does not realize the gift that we have given him. Still, you should oh, join us sure. and be you anti soon. Humanity sucks. I keep telling my friends over here I want to be disgusting half snake all the time. I mean, scales are the future.
So you guys want to keep this fight going? Oh, well, seems like we don't have much choice. You know, if we're going to take out Rasnisi, I think this is a pretty good deal. I mean, we can always come back and kill them when I have Trust another the uh, grenade. Just They're out like of curiosity, snakes. what were you guys doing in there? We were... Of course we work in the service of Dandar. He will rise once more. Yeah, and isn't Dendar going to actually destroy the world? All Just but asking. The, all but the faithful, as you aren't chosen. We shall enter into a realm of unforeseen pleasures. Hey, that's a problem for us. Tiny one. Just saying we were super okay with leaving the creepy guy in the sauna. <laughs> I mean, I don't see a difference. <laughs> Just a dude trying to get well. What do you have against that? Everybody needs a little R and R now and again. Is it because she's a female? Are you that sexist? Nah, mostly because there's a lot of enemies to hit there, and it's fun to hit people, particularly if they're snakes. Yeah, there was all the temple full of sacrificial blood. Just saying. Thor doesn't approve of snakes. Okay. Thor doesn't approve of snakes. Sorry, lady. You know, okay. if we don't have to fight all these guys, we might actually stand a chance against Ras Nisi. Then again, Ras Nisi may not actually end up being so bad, you know? I don't think they're going to help us. I, I would rather have the... Uh, possibility of being resurrected than uh, having being friends with Rasnisi. God bless him. <laughs> Thor, bless him. <laughs> the Yuanti pure blood. This is the lady who escaped the earlier conflict. She steps out of an alcove and whispers to Mac, "I suggest you run. I suggest you run far from this place." Don't listen to her. Yeah, it's don't a, worry, we're all right behind the mill, never get through. A, a wisdom save, DC 12, please, Mac. Oh, God. Why would you oh. look at that? Oh. God, no. <laughs> Let's run. I got a good... Wait, you have... Running. a you have a thing, you have advantage versus charms because you're an elf. Ah, good point, so you get another go. Oh, right, Oof. cool. Please make it. Yay. Ooh. I don't feel like running today. I, I also think this elf. should make you super mad and you should rage. Uh, on He's top of the rage? Raging. I could be super aging. Yeah, like becoming a super saiyan, your rage just get taken to another level. Over 9,000! Max, stop trying to stop getting hit. I'm trying, I'm trying. A longbow strikes you. Holy crap. Twice. Holy. Oh no, and now the Triceratops. The Triceratops, he gets his uh, back leg and uh, leans round and scratches his ear. <laughs> Good, Reiki. We should use them. Against them. Withdraw or something. I mean, you could, could with the raw here and back to the Triceratops, and when they follow after, there's a long. Well, they will be rammed on by uh, charging Triceratops that we can control. Thank you for calling that, uh, Zanax. Yeah, just keep doing those on your own. Yeah. Try to keep up. Uh, 
God, this hurts. What's your AC, Mac? 17. Oh, uh, it shouldn't be 17, by the way. Because I'm pillow wielding. Ouch. Okay, there's an onslaught hitting Mac, but he's still standing. Tough guy, yeah, Xanax. Oh. I'm going to cast Angelic Guardian on Mac, which would give him plus 2 AC. Good call. I'm not sure why that triggered the dexterity save, but okay. I dodged it. No, I didn't. He's trying to dodge the angel. Yeah. So you should have a uh, plus 2 AC now. Should that be visible somewhere? Um, let me just have a look at the spell. That's it. Oh. Oh, you get him um, to reroll deck saves while that angelic guardian's um, upon you as well. Uh, let me just find the effect yeah, for you. Yeah, that also. I just put an avenging angel on you instead, that's no good. No room for all these angels. This one grants advantage attack. You need grants advantage AC. There you go, I've just put um, AC 2 on you. Uh, we'll just check that works, it should do. Alright. Uh, Sunday. Charm her. Be uh, charm something that <laughs> looks like it should be charmed for once. Get out this fuck here flute and just start playing it. Oh, like the bagpipes. Yeah, that'll work. I'm thinking. Less thinking, more fireballs. If only you weren't out. Okay, I am going to try and use a phantasmal force on the lady. All right. The pi I'm going to make her think the pillows are. Mongooses, mongoose, <laughs> mongoose. Okay. Where mongoose? Trying to attack her. We are mongoose is even worse. That did not work. Not in the least. Lucky save, just. Sadly, she resists your charm. Yep. So that's it. Well, you might consider withdrawing, but sure. I might consider a what? Uh, going a bit away from her. Nah. No. Oh. So. It's, it's my hotness heal. that keeps her at bay. I should probably heal. Yeah, I think yeah. I'm gonna waste my action on healing. Don't you have like life steal? I mean, oh, wish. Oh my god, Diablo. next time these Yanti are 
coming around. Mac is gonna be so dead. Please heal him. I can heal you, but only like 1d8. What kind of cleric are you? I'm all wasted up. I used everything. Ah, no action for it. Uh, it's gonna be this tool. Oh, question by the way. In 5e, can clerics uh, spontaneously cast? I didn't see anything about that in the rules, but maybe I missed something. Do you mean uh, you can switch out spells for healing ones? I think you can. Um... That would give me some more options with my spells. I think you can do that. Um, let me just have a look under your class description. Why? I mean, you can use... Uh... Cure wounds as any level spell. Yeah, but well, for one, I have better healing spells. Two, I have to memorize cure wounds. That means one less spell that I have ready. Plus, I have prayer of healing, which is level two, but also like it takes a slot. In my AI. Uh... Uh, did my hit point change now? It didn't? What? Um, no, it's uh, one second I'll put that on as a heal for you. Nine. You've healed nine, okay. Perhaps we should take their uh, offer. I think it's off the table now. We can reconsider. It's our prerogative. I'm sure you can talk us out of this. Ugh, oh god, it's my turn. All I can Sniper. do is shoot arrows. You, you want me to snipe Fantaza? I think. It would probably be better if he cleaned off the trash mobs that keeps hitting on us, but uh, yeah. Okay, sure. I'm not sure. If you have something that can, could maybe delay her, stop her from casting spells would be nice. As long as she's right next to me, I think I can interrupt, like, concentration stuff. Yeah, true. I'll hit anything you guys want me to. Just know that <laughs> I'm in favor of actually taking their offer, because this is not looking good. True. Take down the brood guards. All I think right. kind of, uh, the ship has sailed. I'm they sure you can talk one. us out of anything we need, but I'll hit Brood Guard 1. Xander, you keep talking to her and try to make her go to our side. Oh, damn. Nice. Good job. Second attack. And my extra damage. Try and take out also the pure blood. I doubt I can reach her. There's kind of a wall in the way. I'll take a look at it next. Be careful of Nathan. He packs a punch. Not this time. Oh, thank God. He has two shots. Oh, he missed both of them. Ooh. Would really love if he could withdraw to outside the... Uh, at least so he could get some cover uh, at the end of the corridor here. Sure, I'll move one step back. So you're at 20 now? Uh, it should be 19 AC. Okay. 
And it seems to help. Yeah, that's for 22. Difference. Well, remember, these guys took out a Hydra. Good point. Technically, we took out a Hydra. Yeah, hello. She looks even more determined and she um, whispers to Mac, no, really, really, <laughs> you need to run off, get out of this place. I suggest you go. Make me another wisdom save, please, sir. DC 12 with advantage. Yep, Oof. you're fine. Next time she'll be like, no, really, please, I'm, I'm not getting here. Why the hell won't you run? <laughs> yeah. Okay, Fenzaza. She takes damage, which she's not amused by. But she will cast something nasty. It doesn't Lies. Have to be I'm Maybe. just reminding you, you lovely lady, that the dwarf next to me is the one doing the damage. She casts syphilis. <laughs> right. That's really nasty. That, I'd be below the belt, that would. Um. How is it? Uh, spellcasters get attack opportunity in 5th edition too if they're within melee range, right? No, uh, sadly. They can. Um, ah. it, I think the only thing that gives you the a, a free attack in this is if you step away from someone. Ah, okay. Makes it a lot easier for spellcasters, luckily. Yeah, it does, yeah. And all the other stuff in 3.5, the drinking potions and stuff, that doesn't either. I don't as a spellcaster, that makes me happy. Okay. She um, taps into the nightmares of Xander. Xander, what's your worst nightmare? What do I need honest. to want? The fear of rejection. <laughs> okay, yeah, it would be the fear of rejection. Um, so it's a DC 13 intelligence saving throw, please. Bad hell day. Bad yeah, hell your self-esteem is going to take a hit here. And do I have any kind of advantage on this thing? It is a... Um, it's like a supernatural ability she's got. It's um, not a spell, so... Okay. Uh, oh, have you well, got, oh, it's an illusion. Do you have any bonus against illusions? I don't think I do. Versus charm. It's called common sense. <laughs> <laughs> well, I have one is one intelligence. Well, I can this. only expect good things from this. Oh, oh my oh, god. Woo. Oh, I thought that rolled a 20 then. Oh, yeah, was it a 19? Yeah, oh, and it come out as a nine. Damn it. Um, okay, so you um, have this horrible image. You're having the worst bad hair day. Um, everyone's laughing at you. Um, it's terrible. Your hair's sticking up, and uh, you know, it's terrible. You, you actually take psychic damage from this. You are back in high school. Oh no! And it's so terrifying that you're actually frightened. Damn it, Not Xander, get your priorities in straight. Not the hair. Yeah, 
You've been spending the last months in the jungle using conditioner and shit. Okay, so uh, this um, effect though will last on you, um, your nightmare effect, which means you'll take 2d10 psychic damage every turn. Holy um, crap. But it lasts up to a minute. You can repeat your saving throw at the end of each of your turn. Ending the illusion of success or taking another 2d10 on a failure. So basically at the end of every turn you uh, make the save again. You're going to die due to fear of Wonderful. bad hair. Just like I happy. wanted to go. <laughs> yeah, death by bad high dare day. Positive note, Max standing up to these much better now. Since I'm sorry, I was getting the kiss of death. But generally taking a lot less hits. All right, hit more Broodguard or hit Fantasa. Um, back. Get some Broodguard. What do you guys think? Maybe the the brood guards. Go for the wounded ones. Yeah. Okay, let me quickly see which one I can reach. Number two is moderately, and number three. I can't hit number three. I'll have to go for the moderately hit one. Okay, here goes. Well, I can heal Mac, or I can give me plus two AC. No one seems to be attacking you, or yeah, I was thinking from Fantasa, but I don't know what she'll do. Um, hmm. There is one more thing I can try and do. Will uh, Skellen, my, where is it? I have a can't, the, the saving throws for uh, that Xander has to do their ability saving throws, right? Uh, yeah, intelligence. Is it, does it count for ability? I have a, a, a cantrip called Guidance and it gives you a plus D4 on ability checks. Does that count? Oh, no, I think a saving throw is different to an ability check, I think. Mm. Oh well. Good thought. So I will heal Mac. Almost full. Nice. Longbow guy shoots longbow, misses. And misses twice again. Looks like a wall of steel there. Oh, she gets to go again. Hey, she failed her no, concentration. Oh no. My she gets hit. Yeah. By the spirit guardians and uh, Mac your hair go uh, sorry. Xander, your hair goes back to normal. I know my hair was perfect. <laughs> huh, she's a bit crossed by that. So she Lady, you've just made a powerful enemy. 
<laughs> messing up your hair. Uh, okay, so she'll try to. Um, she casts another spell on you, and you feel all your muscles tight, tighten around you and go stiff, um, as if she's just cast whole person on you. Um, if you could please make me a wisdom. Wisdom saving throw. You're talking about me? Um, sorry, oh. Zande, yeah. Um, 12, damn it, I don't know what her DC is. It looks like she, the thing hasn't been set up right for her one second. Seems like a DC 12 to me. <laughs> uh, actually, in the interest of brevity, uh, I'm going to say you uh, pass that. Woohoo! You anti poor, poor blood, she says. No, damn it! <laughs> Look, will you just leave already? Run, get out of here. <laughs> Make me another uh, wisdom DC 12 save, please. Uh, that's Mac. Huh? Me? Uh, sorry, yes. Yeah, yeah so. she's trying to charm you again. Oh, uh, right. Advantage Mac by wisdom. now is completely too drunk to care. <laughs> yeah, it sounds like it. Well done, bad. No! Oh, that was the last. She, got th she can do it three times a day. That was the last time. So, Mac, um, you are overcome by the uh, suggestion. Also suggesting to run again? Yeah, run, go home. Um, no, damn it. On my turn or on her on her turn? Yeah, it's on, it's on her, your turn. It'll be uh, that you'll need to uh, react to it. So I'll put the um, concentration effect on it because you can break the concentration on her. So another way out of it. So uh, I had to run away from her, by the way, or is it? Uh, and any direction I want. She just said go home, uh, run. Yeah, so she run, go home. All right, so go home. All right, I can do that. It's gonna be a long run. Oh yes, this is gonna take a while. It's like Icewind Dale or whatever you. <laughs> All right, next brood guard. Does that count as within the circle or not? Um. Yes. Go ahead. I can use counter charm on you, Mac, but it will use my turn. Yeah, you still have the dwarf to buff you there. And besides, and uh, wait a minute, yeah, when I run, do I have to use full run movement? Yeah. So no attacking on the road. Unless you've got like a bonus action for a run or something, I guess. Well, I do that too. I got that, but that doesn't go before the end of the running. So, I think I move one back and I try to make her see Nathan over there as a mongoose. <laughs> okay. Does Mac get a save from the fear? God damn it! Oh, she keeps passing. Probably at the she's end of too my smart turn. for me. Why does she have she's not my kind of woman. <laughs> she had advantage on the wisdom saves as well. And that would be my turn. Damn it, stay there. I give you plus two AC so you can stand between me and the bad guys. Maybe you can smack him. Although if you move, your circle of death will move with you. Yes. So I can... Well... 
All right, so I had to use dash. So that means I can use charger. Yay. Okay. That's uh, using dash. Run, man. Knife. Run. 10 feet in straight line immediately before no, taking this bonus action. Hmm. Uh, when I take the bonus action, not when I take the charge, the uh, dash. All uh, right. Uh, should I shove her or should I hit her? I thought you can't do anything other than run. Well, I well I run, and if I run, I can take use the charger feet. That's fine. I'm I'm okay with that. So I can get one attack out of my running. Yay! Try to take off her head. Can do. Ah, that failed. She takes a swipe at you as you run past. Bye, Mac. Jesus, that's a lot of running. Yes, it is. She just catches you um, because you uh, sort of run past. Right. <laughs> Where's Matt gone? Well, I've run. I'm done. <laughs> You're good at running. <laughs> Do you have any kind of save you do after this? Or are you just gonna keep running? Yeah, there Good has point. to be some kind of save, no? Um, the suggestion... Well, let me just check. It's got... Uh, I think it lasts for the duration. Um, let's see. But you can um, break it by hitting fan. Uh, Fanta Zaza, or whatever her name is, and getting her to fail a uh, concentration check. Yeah, oh. not her, the, the Yuanti pure blood. Sorry, yes, it is the Yuanti. That's gonna be the hard one for you. Yeah. See you in a few, few turns. See you next session, Mick. Next yeah. session, yeah. <laughs> you basically continue, yeah, continue for the duration. Oh my god, eight hours. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> So it's run, for us, run. <laughs> I'm gonna be the only one who survives this. <laughs> yes. <laughs> so Tell Mac, the world about us. Tell our story. But um, killing the, that you auntie or getting her to break a concentration will get, get Mac back for you. So. Might I suggest you run? It's a very good training exercise. Right, did I? Okay, this one gets to try and bite Xanax then. Damn it. I knew I should have uh, used the, the plus 2 AC on me. Oh, you're alright, and you maintain your concentration on your spells, which is good. So they're doing a lot of damage at the moment. The Triceratops um, stops what he's eating for a moment with um, you know some grass hanging out of his mouth and watches Mac uh, Watches run past Mac him. run past. Okay. Do you think? Can you get uh, the pure blood from here? Or if you go move closer? I don't know. Let's ask the dungeon master. Uh, if you move a couple of squares closer, um, I'll give you that shot. Um, yeah, Just go on. about there? Yeah, go on. Okay. As my bonus action, I'm going to cast Ensnaring Strike, which means that if I hit the Yanti, she's gonna have to make a Strength Saving Check. Or else take 1d6 dam more damage every... Uh, Okay, let's see what nice. Get my character sheet out. So 
Thank God for your plus 10. Oh, yeah. Woo! Expired! Come home, Mac! Wow, I rolled a 2 and it still hit. <laughs> Come back to us! You beautiful meat shield, you! Okay, let me get all these effects on here. Ugh. So she saved? Or she did, I she succeed? saved. No, she saved. Okay, okay. No worries. But you still did awesome now, um, because you broke her uh, concentration and um, Mac um decided you know, decides it's a good idea to perhaps come home. Um meantime. So that gets struck. Oh maintains the concentration though. Damn, that's a lot of damage. Mark, you're up again. Oh yeah, and I had to get back because uh, or else I'm gonna lose my rage. Get back here in front of me. Are you piggybacking on Xanax? More or less have to. Well, I, I could. Am not, not completely but... against that in this condition. <laughs> I don't think. I don't think you can um, share squares, but you could um, do some sort of drag on him if you wished and drag him away. And get a combined AC of thirty-two. <laughs> well, I don't actually have an action to do that, but uh... I just need an overcoat over both of us. Uh, if we squeeze, it has disadvantage, attack rolls, and dexterity. Oh, yes, okay, you could both squeeze if you wish. Uh... Uh, no, that's okay, I'll go back one. Uh, I don't have any way to action to actually drag you. So I will have to attack Fantas, I suppose, directly. Okay. She's like, oh, you again. Yeah, I thought it over and, you know. <laughs> I'm going to make sure I hit this time, so I'm going to use an inspiration. Oh yes, that's all. Okay. I'm hurting too. It's like 63 hit points. I'm uh, all out no, of everything. I'm just saying if we fall back to the beginning of the tunnel, it won't be one against one again. They'd have to file into the tunnel to get to us, I think. Yep. To be able to hit every single one of them. As so they get pull. behind me. So you guys wanna... By the way, you have advantage uh, to hit uh, Fantasa if you want. Because my rage... I have anyway, I think. But wait, let me check something. So this is guard 2. He's critical. So I'm going to try and hit him. Um going to use my inspiration to make sure I hit him. Uh, 
That was a good choice. Not dead. I will use my lightning damage on him. Good. So he's down. And now I can hit her again. Nice. Oh, well done. And I'm going back. Can I push Xander one back? Um, it, it, it'd be an push, action to do that. Push oh. everyone. You, you yeah, can, you can, <laughs> yeah, push them all back. You can run through them, though. Oh, she's quite cross now. Um... She keeps saving. Can we somehow use the Triceratops to charge into these Yonti? Well, if you can have animal handling, it would be a good idea. I don't think he'll make it through the corridor. I have a plus five to animal handling. So it's what just about uh, dragging the, his head in the general direction, and he runs just wherever he... God, if only I had talked to animals. Stupid spell it was completely useful for 30 sessions, and now that I need it, it's gone. Well, that's a ritual, isn't it? So that's gonna take a long while. Okay, Fenthaza, um, she um, begins to cast a spell, and um, to um, Xander, um, she says, no, look at your hair, your hair, you are having a bad hair day. <laughs> she casts fear, which um, eventually catches all of you with uh, images of your worst fears. So you all need to make me a wisdom 13 magic saving throw, please, against the fear. Uh, that's not the charm, is it? No, Can I take found a uh, illusion? Pom, pom, pom. So inspiration on that one? Sanax is fine, yes, of course, yeah. Uh, you've all got some inspiration, so you can check one of them off before you roll if you uh, wish to. I'm going to oh. use the inspiration, yes, definitely. Same. I saved. Oh my damn god. What's this? I saved. Oh. A zero? I did not. Oh, that makes two of us. Hurrah! Wow, that's bad. Alwyn and Xander both fail. Okay, while well, frightened by the spell, the creature must take the dash action and move away from you by the safest available route on each of its turns unless there's nowhere to move. The creature ends its turn in a location that doesn't have line of sight to you. It can make a wisdom saving throw again. So you can try again once you're around the corner, essentially. Um, it's a concentration up to one minute. So I'll put the concentration effect on it. Again, you can do her damage to break the fear. Oh, nice. So you, you, after you run the again. corner, you can save again. Yeah. I mean, Elven High School, Bellara Moon Mantle has just pulled my pants down in front of the whole class. <laughs> if you're 14, you're in diapers, man. <laughs> That's Elves pretty. don't wear underwear. You're still a baby. She. They just go everywhere. Seeing Sanders moving, she's going to move back out of uh, that um, spirit guardian thing. Mac, you get a free attack on it. Sandy, you would, but I think you're running off. I don't think. Uh... Oh, you might still get your free attack, actually. I think you do. There's nothing that says you don't, so yeah, you can have a one hit. Break her no, concentration. No, he crits, he crits, yes. damn it. Yeah, that's pretty dumb, actually. You can break your concentration now. Oh, you miss. Throw that damage, Mac. No! 
No, that was the GM being a donkey, that was. I should have... Oh, well, never mind. <laughs> so your fear is uh, cancelled as quick as it came. Well, you would have gotten hit if, I, if you were left there anyway. This is such an emotional Trip. roller coaster. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, bad hair day, not bad hair day. Just a one hit on Mac. Um, need to do something. Pretty cool. I don't have any more healing magic. Get out of the tunnel and I will cast ensnaring strike on the whole damn tunnel. Yeah, that's gonna take too long. I have two healing spells. But I really want to charge into her and attack her with my sword. And heal him first. Yeah, I'm gonna slow down the gameplay a bit afterwards because I'm gonna summon my wolves again for the last time. Oh, you wolves are ace. They're very useful. Uh, I'm gonna need to find more wolves later. So, I have a 1d8 heal. Please throw it on me, please. Okay. I just want to survive this one guy here and then as soon as it's my turn, it's going to be Wolf's party. But I really want to charge her. But Wolf's party is going to charge her. We I... need him alive more. I lay my hands upon Max's back and say by the power of the goddess Thor, I heal thee. Ooh, cold. Yeah, I am better, slightly. And I have one spell slot remaining. And that's my turn. No, move back. Yeah, she should probably move back. I don't want to move back. Uh, we need to get away from these crazies. You're going to be left alone in the corridor. No. Twangle, it's fairly low damage considering. Well, I have low heal health, so... I want so hard to heal you. Stop getting shot. Oh, well, we're one in plus still. Jeepest! That doesn't look good. What the hell is that? Sorry, that's my pointer. I do 20 radius um, for the ensnaring strike, so that would be the radius of my spell. And I just sort of... Oh, double Ooh. one on my critical hit. <laughs> don't you have any healing potions? Yeah, but that, they don't do much. He has more health than I have in total, I think. He's That's fine. That's not a good thing. Anyway, wolf time. I'm gonna conjure a last animals. Get one of the wolves in the room with her. Eight wolves. Shove a wolf down the room and then close the door <laughs> wait for the sound to die down I get to kill her she messed with my hell just paste them uh, if uh, uh, GMU just paste them uh, uh, a few inside the room with Fantasa two, two stuck inside the room with Fantasa and then the rest somewhere along the snakes Okay, uh, let's have a look. Make sure the place is filled with them. Uh, how many did you get? Eight. 
Uh, okay, I'll create this account and count it. It'll be easier. Roll the initiative for summoning creatures as a group. It has its own turns. The silence of the wolves. Eight wolves, okay, so you wanted two in the that room and then all the rest with the uh, UNT in the other room, is that right? Yeah. They're not going to survive long, but uh, they're going to they're gonna turn on the, the bastards. That's a lot of wolves. Okay, the smell of wet dog fills the corridors as lots of howling wolves arrive to your aid. And I think that's all I can do. Because that's a standard action, I suppose. Okay. And that's a... Uh, Join the wolves! Close the door! Oh, I'm actually running out of spells with her. That's a bit sad, isn't it? She's used a nightmare. Well, it's a bit boring, I guess, but uh, you get hit by an Eldritch Blast, Mac. Which tries to target you with an Eldritch... She completely misses, I don't know why she bothered. Okay. Oh, she's a Warlock. Good to know. Wolfie number two. I think you should, if you double-click him, you should be able to open the yep. wolves. And, yeah, cool. I was able to. And uh, you get advantage for pack tactics with them. Yep. Mammal power. Oh, critical head, well done. So he's on the ground. Yeah. Oh, cute doggies just want a hug. <laughs> I'm done. Wolfie we'll eight. They're not. <laughs> Man, this is a really good item. Brilliant, isn't it? Is it does it recharge after 24 hours? No, it is just three we've got from that uh, blessing from the snake god thingy, whatever it was. I remember her. I don't think it's a snake god because we're kind of trying to stop that now. Yeah, true. Uh, I don't remember what she was. Uh, Nog no, not a Naga. She was a good Naga, I think, yeah. This is think the second time you've used it? Oh, this is the third. Oh. I'm done. Did 
GM over the turn, please. Sorry. All right, so um, he's now being waylaid by these dogs, so he uh, draws out his scimitar. He needs to get up, too. Oh, yes. Oh, he could stay down. Seems to work. <laughs> he's, yeah. Uh, so as he's getting up, he strikes it. Oh, damn, one moment. I'm sorry, my phone's ringing. Oh, better one moment. Sorry, folks. Too bad that was only two of us who got that blessing. Actually, if I just gain one more level, I'll be able to summon wolves at will. You're my new best friend. So real life, uh, wolves, yeah, uh, not yesterday, but yesterday for before that. I was visiting the zoo with uh, uh, my sister's kids. We've had some sightings of wolves here too, of course. It only took 14 days for, um, for cattle owners to uh, complain about them. So now volunteers are setting up fences everywhere oh, of course they are aren't there subsidies from the government over there like if you get uh, sheep killed by wolves you get your money back or something uh, yes uh, but still there aren't much wolves and there's people down here in the city they complain as soon as any wolves get close by Like it, uh, like it's okay if the farmers have the wolves uh, for us, but if we get wolves, oh panic! Yeah, they're actually pretty skittish, I think. And besides, the uh, farmers reporting wolf attack is way h higher than it's supposed to be. So probably something iffy going on there. It's a government tools project. They're hiding it. Cyborg <laughs> wolves. Or you know, just farmers reporting every damage to sheep as wolf damage. Everyone that goes on the barbecue. Yep.
Good luck. I'm going to left. get oh. some cake. Do that. I want cake. Bring me some more cake for uh, the rest of us. It would also be cool to see bears in real life. We do have at, uh, one bear at least this far south, but probably hard to see it, I guess. We have some in the zoo nearby, but I'm not really a fan of zoos. Yeah, zoos are just sad. Yeah, they are, aren't they? All animals look like they're kind of thin and tired all the time. Yeah, they have like 20 meters to run back and forth and that's just it. Yep. I am out of cake. Good. Yes, if we suffer, you suffer. Man, now we really want cake. Ah, long phone call. Yeah. Uh, here's hoping the new Baldur's Gate is gonna be good. Yeah, they kind of backpedaled immediately after the release, saying it won't be ready for the Google Gaming Store. It won't uh, be ready for what? Open. Well, at at first, people thought that um, there's this Google streaming games uh, shop Stadium. opening up in I think September. In the stadium. Oh yeah. Yeah, Stadia. And and at first we got the impression that it would be ready for that launch. And now they've kind of said, you know, it'll take as long as it'll take. So, yeah. I'm okay so with that. how hot did it get in your countries? It's about 26 degrees right now here. But next week we're going to 37. And no, nothing here has air conditioning, so we all get to suffer. Get one fast. Well, yeah. if I'm lucky, I only have to work half days. Last we, uh, last year, when it got this hot, they said take half a day off. We worked in shifts. Smart. Well, yeah, then I get to hop on the bus that also doesn't have air conditioning, where it's 60 degrees. You literally have sweat like running off your arms in little rivulets. The hottest it got here was in the Dead Sea. It was 50 Celsius. Holy crap. Yeah, I probably wouldn't go outside there. 
Because I think it's illegal here to to have to work when it's over forty or something. Yeah, but everywhere here we have air conditioning. The hardest part was when the telephone uh, a power line fell and we didn't have power for like two hours. It was so hot. Oh yeah, we have that here too. Public transport is by uh, trams, uh, which have these uh, power lines overhead. And when it gets over a certain degree, all kind of failures start happening. So. And that was a freak accident. It just uh, electric pole fell, and the entire city was out of power. No street lights, nothing for two hours. Ah, uh, yeah, it, it's not really an accident here. We simply are not equipped to deal with extreme uh, temperatures. Uh, things also happen when it gets too cold in winter, so... That never happened. We had a weird winter this year. We had a lot of uh, hail, but uh, nothing broke because of cold. Yeah, we had a winter for like a full week this time. Yeah, we sometimes get extra late cold spells and then uh, fruit farmers and stuff, they have to start heating up their orchards with uh, kind of like fire baskets and stuff. That sounds safe. Yeah, it, it's, it, we're kind of not really prepared for any of this freak weather, so... Uh. At least you have waffles named after you. Oh Hello. yes. Hello everybody. Hello, welcome back. I'm really sorry to, to have to do this, but I'm going to have to cut the, the session short. My mum's had a car accident, so um, I'm going to have to go and oh, no. try to sort that. She, okay. Oh yeah, she's fine. Yeah, yeah. There's no, no, but I think it's just um, you know panel damage on cars and things, and no one's hurt and stuff. So it was all. Uh, it's all okay, but I better go and uh, sort that out, I guess. So, um, uh, apologies. Okay, so, I'll thank you for running. You're welcome. Hope you had fun, and sorry it was a shorter session. Ah, no worries. Okay. Hope everybody's safe, and we'll see you in two weeks. Because we're winning the fight. <laughs> yes, <laughs> just trying to get out of it. Now, everyone's safe, so that's the that's the main thing, isn't it, with these things? You know, it's just uh, yep. just cars. Okay, go to her. Yeah. All right, got a dash. Take care, everyone. Have yeah. fun. Thanks for playing. See you. Bye. 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 Bye, guys.